Hi, um, I'm here to present the final product uh, from us for this hackathon. Um, the name of it is called uh, Dynamic Clash Defect Reporting. Um, so this hack consists of two, mainly two components. The first one is the uh, Concrete Defect Management uh, app. Uh, the second is the Clash Detection uh, Dashboard. Um, so um, I'll, I'll first talk about uh, the Concrete Defect Management app. Uh, this app allows you to uh, uh, load a model uh, from an existing model from Speckle and allows you to select individual um, elements. Um, and after you select an, an, an element, you can then add uh, an image file and specify the defect type and you can add some comments as well and then you can then click add defect so what it does is that it's going to add a new defect object uh, to uh, this element in speckle uh, so then um, then other people can access the information uh, through through this and um, another one is the uh, the clash detection dashboard. Um, so in the clash detection dash dashboard, allows us to uh, uh, again select a stream, uh, select uh, the model uh, from different commits, and also displays the um, uh, the uh, all the relevant project information, uh, including the area, grid line, dates. Um, uh, the Revit model name and some description and right here below is to uh, to 3D view um, each one of them represents a different stage of the model um, so the one on the left represents um, the initial model and the one on the right represents the final model so the purpose of this is uh, to help engineers to, to be able to uh, see uh, the updates and modifications um, uh, so that they can keep track of the progress um, of of their design. And below the two 3D views, you can see uh, the text box for uh, clash findings, um, one for action plan, and one for defect. So all the information that has been uh, added to the model from the left web app will be shown here and that's pretty much all about our app. Thank you.